Então, looks good. So now what we have to do is wire up all of our fans. So we have one, two, and three, and then we're going to wire the pump up, which is underneath here. Uh, I think I might run that on a separate channel. I think I might run fans on this one, and then to the other unit that's underneath, I could use those. So yeah, and this is my solution to fix my LED light that went bad in our CPU block. See the CPU? Oh wait, lights up underneath there? Anyway, I'll show you all that later. But yeah, that's what we're doing right now. Is we are currently trying to get all of this fun stuff done. I'm going to try to get you guys a spot real quick. Something for y'all to sit on that these are our power and I got them marked so this is number two and this is number one so we'll go ahead and power those up uh, but we're not but we got to be careful with them because they do have the pumps hooked to them and actually you know what no they don't they only have one of the pumps hooked to it because I got the other one unhooked I forgot okay so I think, how's that, does that look good, yeah, it looks cool, you can see it from this end, plus I can, I can feel it, alright, let me plug y'all back in here, sorry about my hand being in the way, alright, so we got it like that, and then we're going to, see here, that takes up three, one, two, three, and then we'll put this one right here, It's working, but it uh, there's no RGB, no LED coming from it. Uh, I don't know if I like that. I think 
we have plenty of fans up here let's see here so this is a used one but I believe it has RGB in it only thing though is, is it doesn't have a PWM connector let's see. what do y'all think do you guys like how the overall appearance is of it I think it looks pretty awesome in fact I'm the radiators on it are, are just so light it was ridiculous how light these rats were um, they're made out of full aluminum that's for sure there's no copper in them the only copper I think in the loop may be in the secondary pump if there is any but I'm using brass fittings here and we're using a brass one right there but I am very happy with the overall GPU look I do like how the halo fans look real good on it and then this is going to look even better because when we're done with this we're going to have here let me unhook it so it doesn't fall we're going to have two of these and they're going to lay that way long ways like I was showing you guys and then we have our dual our fan controllers as you can see when we twist the knob it makes it brighter see that twist twist and then same with the other channels you can you can make them darker or faster it's mainly for the the fans on the radiators when I want to speed them up or slow them down as you can see when I slow them down the, the light gets darker and then as the speed moves brighter oh hold on my little dog wants out all right Sadie go so the overall project is actually quite heavy I was really surprised guys on how heavy this thing is uh, it probably weighs somewhere in the neighborhood of I'd say when it's fully filled with water probably like 50 60 pounds maybe more um, it's definitely going to look cool because we're going to have these radiators here or I'm sorry these reservoirs and to have two of them like that like boom and then so it'll sit like that and then there'll be a second one like that and then what we'll do is we have the return line right here that's going to run into the reservoir going this way and then coming out of that is going to run into this one now the system has already been charged meaning that there is water already in the radiator and these lines there's there's water in the gpu and there's water in the block and then there's water in this radiator too the only thing is that there's no water in here although when i re-hooked the system up and the and made it um and put the air back through it it loosened this loosened the pressure up and i saw some of the water run back through but it's i'm really happy with it i hope you guys like it we got to figure out a way to cable manage some of this stuff underneath here uh, that's that's really the only thing I'm hoping that the um, the light on this camera looks good sorry about the mess behind me it is what it is I just ordered some pizza and there's not much left of it and we've been working on certain things I've been trying to clean the room up a little bit but what do y'all think you think this looks cool I think it looks awesome I like how I have the dual look now I was thinking that maybe I could take the radiators and put them somewhere maybe liven up the build a little bit more I mean I kind of like the the blue stealth look that it has the I think I did I mean a professional job this 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 looks like something you would buy at a store and yet I built this with my bare hands from scratch I ordered all of these parts individual put it together individual I built this thing in like two nights maybe very excited about it and 
I'm happy with it. This is the 32-bit monster. The only thing we're waiting on is one more of these to come in. And we're gonna, and I already, like I said, I already got it weighted. See, I already got the two ends weighted and weighted to go. One of the ways that I was thinking about livening up the build was if I could take the power supply. See, the power supply has a blue RGB um, fan and light on it. So what I was thinking about doing was taking it off and flipping it and then it be facing inside of the case so that way there's not like this like dark spot because you know you gotta remember the the tanks the, the reservoirs are going to be running this way so you're just going to have like this kind of dark spot sitting there so i was thinking about flipping that tell me in the comments guys if you think flipping this power supply having the blue fan right there would look better I think it would look a lot better doing that and plus also I was thinking about adding another blue RGB fan not like maybe one of these here on the back side um, blowing air into it this way to try to circulate a little bit of more movement because these two right here are blowing air out so yeah I don't know that's kind of my game plan guys so y'all like it give me a thumbs up if y'all like it give me a thumbs up if you guys like it thank you so much this is the 32-bit monster and we're just waiting on one more reservoir and we'll be good to go and while we're doing that I'm gonna sit here and finish my pizza and that's it you guys enjoy your day see y'all later bye now Mm-hmm.